I am the only candidate who can get us out. I'm the only candidate who can get us out quickly because okay. I'm the only candidate who has noticed two facts. Number one, Europe is not offering a second deal. And number two, I'm going to take it through Parliament. So if you signed a campaign pledge, I will not speak ill of fellow Conservatives, I will not engage in personality attacks on others. And you have broken that again and again and again. You've called Boris Johnson a great prancing elephant, a clown, offensive, poisoning our politics, and Pinocchio. Do you look in the mirror when you're shaving in the morning and think, actually, I've let myself down? No. What I learnt in Iraq and Afghanistan is there were too many people trying to be polite. You've said different things now about whether or not you would serve under Boris Johnson. I would in not a Boris serve. Under I any circumstances? Serve. I would not serve. I would not serve under a Boris cabinet. So you would simply open up another parliament in Methodist Central Hall over the road. Have you spoken to anybody else about this? Have you spoken to the Speaker about it? Have you spoken to colleagues about it? Would there be anybody apart from Rory Stewart sitting in that building? If somebody suspended parliament, I mean, if they literally tried to block our parliamentary democracy, I am very confident that every single member of parliament would join me in Methodist Central Hall. Mm. Um, so I would start with parliament, and if I couldn't get it through on the first stab with parliament, okay. you'd go to the Citizens what? Assembly, and it would work like this. You would go to select randomly from the electoral register 50,000 people. You would then, as you say, write or phone them to check who's available, mm. and then you'd use a polling company to make sure they were representative of the country, north against south, women against men, Brexit against no Brexit. And the reason to do it is to release the pressure from Parliament. Then is what is the worst case scenario, yeah. Andrew? I would have wasted a few weeks of your time and we would have to go back to Parliament again. In the circumstance of no deal, he would vote to bring down a Conservative government to stop that happening. Would you? I keep getting asked this again and again. And important I'm, question. It's, it is an important question mm. if I lost, but I'm going to win. Because in the end, I believe in the Conservative Party members and I believe in my colleagues.